Yeah, there was. There was a um, couple of little individual errors, more so than team structure, you know. Uh, and um, they're easily fixed, those ones where Nicky wasn't in the line and then Chance come up out of the line. It was a, uh, they're easily fixed. They're young kids who will fix that very quickly. Um, structurally, overall, our defence, um, take away a couple of those tries. I mean, that, that one off the bomb where Jack threw the intercept and then they scored off the back of that. I mean, that's against a run of play. And there's two or three tries there, I believe, that um, we can fix quickly. Um, <clears throat> there is a, um, we're at where we're at at the moment and there's a heap of improvement in that squad. You said yesterday you knew that the line would be you know, broken at some point. Have you about how the side would you know, eventually handle that? How, how did you think you guys did today? Well, have you seen the second half. What do you reckon? Good comeback. It was. It was, it was a uh, huge effort a, um, against a very good football team. So, um, you know, we didn't go away. And that effort in the second half shows his character in this joint, in this, in this squad, the, uh, in, the, in the footy team. And, um, I'm OK with who we're at at the moment. We're playing against Melbourne, who I see as a, uh, one of your benchmark teams, for us to come back into that and uh, got us back into the game. And we score that try or, you know, I get a bounce there off one of those bombs and put it back to six points uh, difference. It's a... Bit of, bit of heart in that team in regards to coming back against a, a very good footy team. Did that break from Kafusi downfield kind of let a bit of the momentum off that you sort of built up in that first Yeah, let a, let a little bit off, but you know, to their credit, they uh, come back and just jump straight back into the game. You know, they bounced back into it. They didn't uh, drop their lip. Is that sort of what you take out of it, Ricky, is that um, you've sort of seen where you're at and, and the guys sort of kept fighting on? David, I, um, what I see, mate, is... Um, a lot of different combinations, a lot of different faces in that team, one less than last week. Um, <clears throat> we've got uh, a load of improvement in that footy team yet. How's Joe Tarkin? Was he injured or just hooked? No. Hooked. For what? I don't know, just in that first 20, is he got an injury or...? What would he be hooked for, though? <clears throat> a couple of missed tackles or something. No, I'm not that uh, tough, mate. He, he had a bad thumb last week. He played on with a uh, thumb. It could be a fracture um, from tonight, but uh, scans will tell the scans will tell the story. But uh, so uh, just hope that he's okay. He's, he's a very important part of our team. How much did that hurt? With the forwards like look like they might have struggled to find some momentum in the first half. Yeah, it hurts losing an international player, but it's not an excuse. We've just got to. Um, carry on and, and move forward, and they did that. This shows the, the versatility in the pack, though, with um, <coughs> John obviously able to, to switch over that edge and um, the other guys sort of come along in the Yeah, we. Um, I think the first uh, 15 minutes of the game is our worst part of the game. You know, if we could have replayed the first 15, I think we'd be, uh, you know, we'd be a little bit better, but again, you know, credit to a very, very good football team. They, uh, they got away on us. We, uh, Fought hard to get back into it, but we just didn't go all the way.